Hi there, now it's time to use Raycast using 3JS. So my suggestion is go to the official website and then check the documentation up and looking for in the box on the top right, left the world Raycast. Ray, Ray, let me, Raycast. Yeah. After that, you will find this documentation which offer you at the beginning uh, a mouse caster but if you scroll down a little bit you will see the properly documentation which tell you what, uh, what parameters you need to pass on the constructor method and what properties you have and what method you can use so we are get ready our setup now we are with a common scene with a with a cube, a green box. So now we are going to um, implement the raycast, but using the the example. So the mouse raycasting system. And after we will see the raycast customized ray, raycast uh, where we can choose uh, we can trigger raycast from anywhere to everywhere um, so that's it we are going to start we are going to copy this as you can see let me show you we're going to copy those uh, variables that we are going to need but we are going to use the ecmascript script 6 syntax module class in the classes so we're going to make this constant as the properties of the class now we are going to copy this um, on mouse uh, event handler as a method we need to fix the variable this way now into the loop okay we need to set set up the the even listener we have to go use the as a event handler this method so we need to pass it here and bind it because we are using inside of the even handler the variable this so we need to set the context and we say the context of that function will be the same instance of the class that's why we are going to access the mouse which is set it up setting up another method so after that we just we are able to copy those lines that make the magic happen but we are going to do it inside of the mouse event in order to don't overload the loop with functionality we just will make the all the work inside of the event handler so after we will copy the next line so if you can see everything is here the scene the mouse the camera so this is the intersect intersections between the raycast we made with the mouse and the children scenes so inside the scene we have too many children's many children's and uh, we check all of them if you want to check another uh, set of object you just pass them in, a, in an array here this is an easy way to pass all the children of the scene of the scene but you maybe you don't need it so you can change this up and this says if you intersect someone they are going to be in order of proximity to the camera 
So the, the closest is going to be first. The first is going to be the last one. Uh, so that's why we have a, an array with index. So uh, we can just all we are going to change the color to all of them. In order to change the color, we use the object material object is the property of this array that contain the mesh so that mesh contain the material and that mesh and that material contain the color property that we can set in this way they will use the color blue because i like the blue today so after this now we can test it up Hopefully this is working. Let me see. There is a problem. We will check. There is three is not defined, so we need to import JS. Now we have our our green box. But if we mouse over the green box, tada! Nothing happened. Why? Why not? We have a recaster is not defined. We are missing uh, some this keyword. Now it's working. So we're going to refresh the page. So if we place the mouse over the, the green box, it's going to change to blue. And um, that's it. That's all by now. Hopefully you enjoy it learn something about it see you till the next one